Welcome to Prudent Psychology 101. Today we are going to learn about domains of cognitive psychology, the various domains of cognitive psychology. Cognitive psychologists often broaden and deepen their understanding of cognition through research in cognitive science. And this cognitive science is a cross-disciplinary field that uses ideas and methods from cognitive psychology, psychobiology, artificial intelligence, philosophy, linguistics and anthropology. So now let us look at uh, the various uh, domains of cognitive psych- psychology. Um, they are uh, modern cognitive psychology freely draws theories and techniques from 12 principal areas of research and they are cognitive neuroscience, perception, pattern recognition, attention, consciousness, memory, representation of knowledge, imagery, language, developmental psychology, thinking and concept formation, human and artificial intelligence. Let us now look at uh, the key issues in the study of cognitive psychology. They are nature versus nurture. Nurture. We may emphasize uh, nature that is innate characteristics of human cognition or nurture that is the environment in the study of cognition. Rationalism versus empiricism, the truth about ourselves and about the world around us may be approached through applying reason and logic or by observing and testing our observations. Structure versus processes, psychologists may study the structures of the human mind or human thinking processes. Domain generality versus domain specificity, the process or observation may be studied as limited to a single domain, apply also to all domains. And then validity of casual inferences versus ecological validity. Psychologists may use controlled experiments for valid inferences regarding casualty or they may use more naturalistic techniques for ecological validity. Applied versus basic research. Some research may be inclined towards practical applications and yet others may be conducted into basic cognitive processes. Biological versus behavioral methods. The brain and its function may be studied directly during the performance of cognitive tasks or people's behavior in cognitive tasks may be emphasized. Let us now look at the various key ideas or concepts in cognitive psychology. Behavior can be explained in terms of how the mind operates. The cognitive model looks at the role of cognitive factors such as thoughts, feelings, attitudes and beliefs on behavior. The cognitive model sees the individual as an active processor of information and it is the way we perceive, anticipate, interpret and evaluate events rather than the events themselves that has the greatest impact on our behavior. The mind works in a similar way to a computer, input storage and retrieval of data. Cognitive psychologists see psychology as a pure science. I hope this was useful for you. Please uh, kindly subscribe our channel like it do comment